Hey, what's up, everyone? This is iTorrent Gamer. I'm here to show you how to disable the internet. All right, so basically, I'm going to go ahead and show you the commands that we're going to be using. Go ahead and open command prompt. I'm going to be typing in ip config space forward slash, and we're going to be using ip config space forward slash renew and forward slash release. So, that being said, we are first going to start off by going to new text document. This doesn't really matter. And we're going to type in here IP config space forward slash release. All right. So that being put in there, we're going to go ahead and file, save this as a batch file. We're going to name it internet dot bat all right then so we're going to save this and before i run this i'm going to show you that the internet is up and running go ahead and go to youtube and see that it is up and running now if i run the batch file so it ran the crit, the uh a script real quick and here we go we can go back here and go to youtube again and there you go, you see server not found, page problem loading page. Basically cannot get on here. So we go to Google, show you that it's most definitely not working. There you go, problem loading page. Now, now to renew it to make the internet work again, we're going to go ahead and do text document. Doesn't matter what the name is. We're going to go ahead and put IP config space forward slash renew. Now we're going to save this as a batch file. How about we put internet to dot bat save. We're going to run this Windows IP configuration. It's loading. We ran the script. And then go ahead and open this, and you will see that the internet is up and running once again. Now, I'm going to show you a little trick that I have used in the past. If you ever get on someone's computer and want to do a joke or use this as you wish, you can go ahead. You cannot make a shortcut of this batch, or you cannot make a make the, the icon different. If you go into properties, there's no way in changing the icon. Now, what you can do is create a shortcut. Now, shortcuts, you can make a change the icon. So we can go to properties and go to ahead and change icons. And we're just going to go ahead and throw this on there. I know that's not the, the Internet Explorer sign. That is, if you want the Internet Explorer sign, you you can go ahead and browser and go ahead and look for the Internet Explorer directory and put it in there. But for this example, we're going to go ahead and use this little globe and apply it and then click OK. And then we can go ahead and type whatever name we want on it. So we can leave it Internet. And then it'll be just like this. It'll look like a shortcut internet, and it just looks like a direct link to the internet. And once someone runs it, they'll see that black box pop up and then wonder what, what just happened. And if they have another shortcut to the internet, it doesn't matter what Explorer or Mozilla, it doesn't matter what they're using. And they go ahead and try to type in an address, it just won't work. So that was just a little little thing that I wanted to show you all go ahead and uh, post this video now I hope this video helped somebody maybe I had problems actually trying to re-enable your internet and this video will show you how to and that's pretty much it this is another video for my torrent gamer take care